We're here today in County Mayo for the latest instalment of Celtic FC Foundation's Summer Games programme for 2022. The Summer Games programme has been established to give young people an opportunity to play sports, access coaching and playing tournaments at a time when families are finding it particularly hard around money and funding and free access activities are absolutely critical for keeping young people engaged at a time of year when they don't have a lot to do. My name is Tony Hamilton, I'm the Chief Executive of uh, Celtic FC Foundation. So Ireland's really important to us. The football club is a Scottish club with proud Irish roots. We were formed uh, by an Irishman at the end of the 19th century. So it's important that we maintain that. It's great to be bringing summer games to the west of Ireland where Celtic FC have got significant roots. The founder of the club, of course, was born in Ballymoat in County Sligo, which is just up the road from, from the ground that we're at today. We're being hosted here at Ballinar Town Football Club, who've been an absolutely pivotal partner for us in rolling this programme out this summer. Uh, their, their coaches have been helping us to manage the games and they're going to be helping us put on a fantastic tournament for under 12s and under 16s here at their grounds this afternoon. Yeah, I think it's, uh, it's amazing that it's Celtic FC at Foundation are running programmes like this in the West of Ireland because basically it's, it's so removed from the rest of the country when it comes to big cities and stuff. But for our kids to have access to a huge club like Celtic and a global name like Celtic and people to be associated with that around here, it's amazing. The Summer Games programme brings together young people from across all of the communities around Ireland. Uh, today uh, we will have young people from Sligo and Mayo in the west, uh, but we also have some guests coming down from, from some of the estates in Belfast uh, who will be playing in our under-16s tournament. What we hope to see is a great day of excitement, fun, activities and some good football uh, as these guys get together to play for trophies. What we do in Ireland is a couple of things. We run these school games projects and really that's diversion from different parts of the population at times when the schools are closed and that's about including people who might not be included but it's also about providing support for people, for families, providing food while the schools are closed and that's really important to us. Football is for everybody, so I mean, it's it's an accessible sport, easy to, you know, you just need a ball, you can go anywhere, you can go on a green, you can go on a, on a road, on a street, and you can play any time of the day or night, like we all did with jumpers on the ground till the sun went down and playing the last goal win, so football is very important, you know, in the, in, in the modern day society, with things, you know, as you said, but things been so expensive, kids, all they need is a football.